Mmm, my face is a mess. Y'all, I look a mess, do you boys? I'm in my dirty little bathroom, I'm gonna do my hair. Japan. So I've been to that one. And it's so fucking beautiful. Um, but of course, I didn't have my nugget then. So the second biggest aquarium in the world is Atlanta. So we're going to go here. We're going to go see the fucking fishies today. And he's super duper excited. Like My nugget is so excited. I said, nugget, you want to go to the aquarium? He said, a cam? <laughs> a cam? So that's where we gotta go. Not as beautiful as you. Oh, you guys are so, so, so freaking cute. It's so nice to me. You're just so nice. You know, sometimes that can be mean to me. I don't know why, but. But today is love. Today is love today. I haven't done my makeup. I haven't done nothing. I just really woke up. And start curling my hair. I'm gonna go get some coffee. Where is my coffee? I live off coffee. Hi. Um, so today, Sundays are normally dedicated to my nugget. I normally spend a lot of time on my nugget on Sundays. I spend a lot of time on my nugget, period, but I try to like definitely dedicate nugget. No, if you give me my makeup palette, because what is we doing today? Go play. No, no, okay? All right. You pushing it. Thank you, guys. Um, but on Sundays, we try to, you know, bring it in with him. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So, yeah. I'm kind of excited, y'all, because I'm a big kid myself, so... I'm kind of fucking excited. I haven't been to the aquarium. I So in the St. Louis, the zoo, I used to like going to the zoo a lot because in St. Louis, the zoo is fucking free. And in St. Louis, a lot of stuff are fucking free, y'all. That's why 
I like my hometown because I think the only thing that's not free is the um, city museum. That's not free. That's most definitely not fucking free. But it's worth the money because I used to take my children to like the, um, we used to go get headwinds and all types of shit and be literally going through the tunnels. So I do miss that. Whatever. We're gonna make it through here in Atlanta. What are y'all doing? I'm up here just talking y'all fucking ear off. What y'all doing today? Today is now that's TV Sunday. So make sure you guys are tuning into now that's TV. Cause I don't know what the fuck they're gonna be. I don't even know what's airing today, y'all. South Central Daddy's ass. Um, I don't know what else. Is there anything else dropping? Oh, I think Deja Vu trailer, or not trailer, um, reunion. Yeah, so just make sure you guys are tuned into Now That's TV. You don't know what Now That's TV is. I don't know what the fuck can tell you, because you should know what that is. I talk about that all the time when I'm on here, and za, 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 za. Oh shit, I'm dropping shit. Do I 360? My stomach is swollen as fuck right now. Uh. <laughs> That's it. That's a 36 day. That's what's going on here. <laughs> I just made me miss my coworker. My coworker is funny as fuck. When she gets stressed out at work, she'd be like, What's going on here? <laughs> and her voice get high just like that. <laughs> funny as fuck. Yeah, I like really suck at curling my hair, so please don't ask me no questions. Like I literally just learned how to curl my hair like a little while ago. I literally used to put mousse in my hair. I don't know if y'all remember. I used to dead ass put mousse in my hair with no curls. Hold on, y'all. she's gonna get yeah I do not like curly hair I'm not curly and she's colored hair so I'm probably just gonna go <laughs> buy another wig and put my hair in just like this I wear my hair like this with every fucking wig I don't I don't know it's just how I like to wear my hair hi hi how are you how are you guys how are you guys feeling Do my baby hairs. I forgot. I, do I have to like re glue this wig? No. Okay. But I'm not talking about shit, y'all. I'm not talking about a fuck thing. I just literally came on here to say hi. I came on here to say hello. This is not me shaking my ass. I'm not on here doing that right now. You said I already know what to do. And what is that, my love? What is that I already know what to do? Tell me I already know what to do. And what and what is that? What is that that I already know what to do? Can I say 
victim thing. Can I be completely honest with y'all? I love y'all. Y'all know I fuck with y'all. We fucks with each other. You know, because, you know, y'all really love me. Y'all be paying my bills. <laughs> but, you guys, sometimes I don't want to come out here and shake ass. And that really has to be okay, because we did that yesterday. And we had a good time yesterday, right? We had fun, right? Right. We had blasts. Right? But that cannot be every single waking moment. Get me? Like, it just cannot be because I don't feel like it. And the bitch is just exhausted some days and don't feel like doing it every waking moment. Get me? Got me? Okay, cool. I love when we have an understanding. You scared this shit out of me because I literally just came from Dunkin' Donuts. Oh my god! They got the chocolate donuts in Philly. You know they discontinued them out here. Was it out here? Yes, it was out here. They discontinued the Dunkin' Donuts out here, y'all. I mean, not the Dunkin' Donuts. The chocolate donuts. Like, if you guys know, like, my favorite donut is the chocolate donut. Like, it's the chocolate. It's a chocolate glazed donut. But there was a donut at Dunkin' Donuts. It was like a, um... It was a triple chocolate donut. Sorry, y'all. I'm having to stop and think sometimes since my kid is. He's so bad. Blaze on. Blaze on. Blaze. Come here. Um. That was a chocolate donut. Um. A triple, double, whatever the fuck. Donut and Dunkin' Donut. And they just continued it. So the fact that y'all remember that. I was really sad about that. What is your name? Kenny. Kenny, Kenny, Kenny. It's um, 12 o'clock and you're asking what that ass look like. What it's been looking like, Kenny. Like, what it's been looking like, Kenny. Is your name Kenneth? I'm just, I'm curious, you know. Or is it like something like canard? <laughs> I don't know. I'm just asking. I just want to know. Is Kenny shot for canard? Or Kenneth? Kendrick? Please. Um, just. No, it's okay, baby. It's no. I'm just saying. It's just really early. For me, anyway. It's nothing. It's not a big deal. It's not a big deal. I'm just saying. It's earlier. Oh, you know what? And I gotta go find me a church, y'all. I used to go to church a lot when I was in Charlotte. I had to go find me a church out here. I really feel like I need to start going back to church, too. I mean, listen, nothing's gonna change as far as how I am, but I'm very... Just because I do what I do don't mean that I'm not close with God. Doesn't mean I don't pray. Um, yeah, so I really feel like I need to start going back to church and because I be having some hard days, some days, y'all. Takes a lot to be me. Um, I don't, I don't, Blaze, come here. I don't, um, marriage isn't something that I automatically want to jump into. Um, I've been, I was married for 10 years, um, and it's not, it's not something I want to just jump. Who's, how many, 160 people, okay, cool. Marriage isn't something I wanted to jump back into, and I feel like, Marriage is beautiful, but it's not something that you have to do right away. Um, there's so many. Oh, don't burn me! I'm too cute for being burned. Um, it's 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 so much you should learn about a person before you feel like you should just get married. Um, 
I, like I said, I was made for 10 fucking years. Um, a long fucking time. But I was with that person since I was like 14. Like, so, get to, I feel like it's, it's more important that you have a bond and to get to know someone ends it out. And then that could be just something that y'all do once you feel like y'all are locked in, locked in. But you shouldn't feel like marriage is going to lock you into something. You should already feel locked in with somebody. And it, I, it really just, I really don't like when people go into something and just be like talking about babies and talking about marriage. Because I just feel like, whoa, whoa, whoa. You know, like, can I get to know you? <laughs> Can I even see if that's an if that's an option? Because one thing about me is like I don't really care how people view me. How you view me, okay, cool. But like how I am and how we get to know each other and things like that, you know, I'm sensitive about my shit. I don't just waste time with any and everybody on. And you shouldn't do that. So when you ask me about marriage, you're asking me about marriage on here. I'm like, that's not something that comes to my mind. It's not something I'm thinking about right now. <laughs> I'm not talking to nobody who's making me think about that. Nobody, you know, like, oh my God. It's not, I mean, I don't know. You guys really just got to start talking to girls and be like, damn, this is going to be my wife. Like, how long do you know them before you, or do you like see them and be like, damn, I want to marry her? I, I don't know. I've been married already. Maybe that's why. You want to speak about my ass. I'm about to go. Not irritating me. I just got to do my baby hairs. My girl told me they can't do their hair and makeup. I'm like, girl, you got to get it together. I mean, like, anybody said you got to be a pro, but you got to do a little one, too. I got to do my baby hairs. And this time I have to make my baby hairs lay down. Mm. Um, I've never been to Trinidad. I've never been to Trinidad before at all. Like, how is it over there? Is it like, I hate to sound stupid. Is it like a well put together country? Like, it's not like Haiti. Is it like Haiti? No shade, no shade, no shade. Maybe five dissertation, so no shade. No shade, no shade. But what's it like over there? Yes? Yes? Fish. I know we're gonna go see fish. We're gonna go see fishes. Yeah. We're gonna go at two. You don't have to beg me. We're going, okay? Give me a kiss. Come closer. Okay, go, go. You didn't even give me a kiss, Papa. Papa, you didn't give me no kiss. You're so little, dude. Yeah, we're going later on. Huh? He thinks we're going right now. Like, he's freaking out. I shouldn't just. I should have waited to tell him. I should have told him, like, 1 o'clock. Now he thinks we're going now. We're not going right now, Baba. Papa, we're not going right now. Not right now. He's yelling at me. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, baby. We're not going right now. Not right now. I gotta go. <laughs> I finished my hair. I got my makeup. I mean, am I doing my makeup? Right now? Not right now. Papa, no. No. Mm -mm, no. Absolutely not. Okay, you can have that, but no. Um, yeah, I haven't, like I told you, I haven't been to the aquarium in like six years. So I'm super duper duper excited to see the fishes. The one, I'm telling y'all, the one in Japan is freaking beautiful. You get, so, it's beautiful. You get off it, you get onto an escalator, and then you come down. And when you come down, you just see the beautiful sea. The aquarium is like super duper open. It's like really beautiful. Um, it's really beautiful. No, I'm not clapping. I don't feel like it right now. I don't feel like it right now, y'all. Jesus Christ. Y'all love this ass. And I really don't feel like clapping it. I don't feel like it, y'all. 
sometimes I don't feel like clapping my ass all the time. I know y'all love me and I love y'all too, but sometimes I don't feel like doing that. Oh shit, here's my brush. Um, the next person who asked me to clap my ass and I just said I don't want to is gonna get blocked. Cause I really, I literally just told y'all, no. I literally just told y'all no. Y'all like, please clap it. What that be doing for y'all? Like, I'm not. This not even me being rude. I love y'all dearly, but like, damn. Y'all be nothing when I be clapping. Like, what is? What is it? Thank you. Thank you. It, it's. It's. I, I just. Sometimes I don't feel like doing that. I love me. I love y'all too, but sometimes I don't. I don't really feel like doing that. I'm tired. I just woke up. I don't feel like the first thing I'm doing is shaking my ass, and I like clapping my ass. It's my ass, so you know it's not a thing to do it, but not all the time. <laughs> what y'all be doing? Y'all be like when I clap it. Oh, that's a serious question. I'm dead ass serious. Like, what y'all be like? What is it? What's going on? Like, y'all be at the screen like, like what's going on? Whack, whack, whack. Y'all be choking y'all chicken? Like, what's goody? I know y'all be choking y'all chicken. <laughs> it's a pretty, it was, I feel like, I feel like before I got it done again, it was pretty. Now, like, you don't understand. You guys see how small my frame is? Do y'all see? Like, do y'all see how small my frame is? When I say frame, I mean, like, my actual waist. My waist is like last I checked my waist is a twenty four. But right now it's probably it's swollen. It's probably a twenty six right now because look how so I don't want you guys my this onesie is like it's not hugging my body right now. So don't don't pay attention to this. Don't pay attention to this. Because this right here will literally my waist is a twenty four, my ass is like a fifty four. But when I'm swollen, my waist is a twenty six. So imagine you not being able your waist being so small and your back being so fucking like like no fat or nothing, right? I gotta clap this ass, my back be hurting. Y'all don't understand. But y'all be like, clip it in, clip it in. Let me see it clip. Let me see you clap your ass. Who's gonna clap their ass for me? <laughs> Who's gonna clap their ass for me? I know one thing. If shit don't get better these couple in the next what year? I'm gonna marry a bitch. I'm gonna marry me a nice, pretty Mary. It's whoa, whoa. I'm gonna have a relationship. I'm gonna give me a girlfriend. I'm gonna give me a girlfriend and she's gonna be chocolate with a big butt. Cause I'm gonna have her clap that ass for me. Cause I've been clapping this ass for y'all niggas. I wanna see somebody else clap it for a change. But let me not um, get on here sounding like a sad ass bitch because I know what the fuck I got myself into and I know what the fuck I be doing. So let me not even get on here and try to make it seem like... Let me not get on here and try to make it seem like... Oh my God, I can't believe I'm doing it Because, I mean, that's not the case. I know what the fuck I got myself into. Just sometimes a bitch be kind of tired of clapping it all the time. That's all. That's it. Not special. Hi. Do y'all have girlfriends? Do y'all have girlfriends? Like, I really do be having clients hit me up and be like, you know, y'all know why I used to go live quiet? Y'all you know why I used to go live quiet? Y'all know why? Because this guy told me that he had a girlfriend and that he be wanting to watch me. But, like, his girlfriend don't like it. So, he be like, can you go live quietly? And I literally did that. And you know how many niggas used to be like, thank you for doing quiet lives. Like, thank you. I can be on your live quiet. And, you know, I don't really like to um, push that type of shit, y'all. I really don't. If your bitch does not like me and she don't want you on my page, don't be on my page, y'all. I ain't trying to come. I ain't trying to get beat the fuck up, y'all. For real. 
Cause y'all probably got big bitches. I don't. I don't like fighting big ass girls. I ain't trying to get beat the fuck up for real. Cause you know I, I say beat the fuck up because when the bitches be fighting over they nigga, that's different. You know when you fight a girl and it's over respect, it it be you know it be like, you know if y'all be mad like we be mad, but we don't be that mad. But fighting over some dick is different. Like I feel like the strength just like. I don't know where that strength come from. Like, you bitches be mad, mad. When well, y'all be fighting over some dick. I had a bitch try to fight me in a club, y'all. Because that nigga had me in his section and he invited me out. He invited me out. Had me in his section paying for shit. And then the bitch wanna fight me. I'm like, why you wanna fight me for? I didn't know that was your nigga. I don't be not. I don't be, I don't like to engage in shit like that. I don't. It's never that deep. It's never that deep for me to be talking to a nigga I know got a bitch. That's trifling. I would never do no shit like that. But I literally did that because I'm like, okay, whatever. You just want to watch a live. Okay, whatever. Cool. But you really shouldn't be on my shit. If you got a bitch that told you to stay off my page, then just stay off my page, homie. Like, I don't want no smoke. I don't want you to, I don't know what y'all got going on. Like, it ain't never that deep. Shorty said, stay off my page. You just stay off my page, y'all. Because them bitches be really, really in my DM crying about you niggas. Whole time, they be clients. Like, these niggas be paying me for videos. Like, I don't really be, you know what I'm saying? Baby, I'm not finna be meeting up with your nigga. Her clients, that's all. Hey. Yeah, if your bitch said she's uncomfortable with you being on my page, then just do what she say. Oh God, like just do what the girl said. The girl said she don't want you on here, then just don't be on here. I'm just saying, I'm just saying. My curl lines broke, like the spring popped out of them like last week. I really need to go get some new ones. <laughs> I need to go get some new ones and I'm just lazy. You a Will Smith fan? Here's the thing, Stanny. I don't know enough to form no opinion, so I don't fuck none. I don't know enough. I don't want no. I don't want partaking that. I don't know what the people got going on. I ain't finna speak on none of that. I ain't never really uh gave it too much thought. <laughs> to be honest, I never really gave it too much thought. People don't like Jada. People don't like Smith. Will Smith. I don't know. I don't really be in them people. Them people don't give a fuck about me. So, <laughs> what am I forming opinions about people who don't care about me? So, I don't know. Are you a Will Smith fan? <laughs> Are you? Do, do you get paid to be worried about these people? I swear to God, y'all, like, no, I'm not even trying to be funny. Like, I really don't be caring. These people don't give me no money, they don't make me no money, they don't pay none of my bills, I don't care. I wish them the best though. I wish Jazz the best. I wish Will Smith the best. I hope they can fix whatever they got going on, I don't know. Yes, I have given someone a golden shower. I've had a golden shower done on me. I feel like when you're in a relationship, listen, a lot of freaky shit, like, I don't know, my freak flag and the things that I will let someone do to me when we locked in, I will do, I will let you do whatever fuck. Seriously. You're my man. You're my man. A hundred grand. Like, you're my man. You're my man. Like, my body belongs to you. Your body belongs to me. We can do whatever the fuck you want to do. I've let, I've let my man pee in my mouth before. Like, I've sucked my man's toes. I've done a lot, but I ain't never ever ate nobody's ass. That's I draw the line with that. Like I can't, I get my ass ate, but I ain't never done that. I ain't never done that. I know what you're thinking. You let somebody pee in your mouth. Yeah, I do. I did let somebody pee in my mouth. I did let somebody pee in my mouth. Yeah, I peed in his mouth too. I peed in his mouth. He peed in my mouth. He ate my ass. I did not eat his ass. We don't eat ass around here. I'm sorry. Like, that's just... Eating a man's ass is insane. That's insane. I don't do that. But I have let a man pee in my mouth. My man. 
my man, I let my man pee in my mouth. I, you know, I've done a lot of nasty shit. I mean, like, it's sex. You're supposed to be that way with somebody you love, y'all. And, like, I feel like, you know what I don't like, neither? I don't like sex shaming. Like, when you break up with somebody, I feel like the sex shaming is crazy. Like, I can't even, like, okay, but you just had, you just had my nuts in your mouth. Okay, but today I don't want to beat you. <laughs> so, like, why y'all be doing that? I don't like when people do that. I feel like that's lame. We grown. If you fuck up and we arguing, then we, you know, we just arguing. But to try to slut shame somebody and be like, oh, you, but you had to, da, 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 like, yeah, but you're still the fuck wrong. And I was a squirrel with your nuts in my mouth, but you still a cheating bastard. And I just caught you. So, like, you feel me? Yeah. Y'all follow me. Um, yeah, you know, the first thing. What? Why are we talking about that? <laughs> Amanda said this too deep. I has to go. <laughs> what the fuck? I like. I mean, man, I just be answering questions. They be asking me questions. I be answering them. That's all, baby. It ain't no too crazy. Yeah, it ain't, it ain't nothing crazy, y'all. Nothing crazy, nothing crazy. Nothing crazy. But I do feel like, um, another thing y'all gotta understand too, like, if you watch my content, y'all know that I've been fucking the same person over and over and over. Y'all have never ever seen me fuck somebody different. If you go look at my content, you guys can see that my content comes from one person and one person only. I, I don't, I, and no slut shaming. We're not slut shaming. Let me pause there. We're not slut shaming. So like, if you fuck multiple different dudes, that's, that's on you, baby. Ain't nothing, you know, I'm not slut shaming. Like, I'm not coming in here to say, oh my God, you're a hoe. Like, no. I say that to say this, like, I just literally cannot be, um, I can't, I just, I have to be with somebody that I can do the same shit with all the time. I don't, I'm not strong like y'all. Some of y'all are too strong. Like, I literally cannot be fucking a content creator because I can't, first of all, I can't take no, I feel, okay, I feel bad. For any OnlyFan girly that literally take an OnlyFan content creator serious. Like, these niggas fuck for a living. Like, uh-uh. Like, I am tough. I feel like the girlies that take OnlyFan content creators serious and, like, have relationships with them, like the males, females are different. Females are completely different. I stand by that. We're not going to talk about that. But, like... Male content creators, you do not need to be taking no male content creator. That nigga fucks for a living. He's going to fuck that bitch tomorrow. He's going to fuck that bitch tonight. Whenever the check clears, whenever the check come in, when the check's about to be pending, he needs to fuck that bitch. He going to fuck that bitch. And do you think I'm going to let my man go fuck a bitch for some money and then come lay up next to me and tell me, bitch, baby, it's just work? Y'all some strong bitches. Y'all just as strong as the bitches that be taking it in the ass. I, uh-uh. Because I feel like you content creator niggas, y'all the biggest fucking players and the biggest sadistic motherfuckers I've ever seen. I be watching y'all. Y'all literally will fuck the fuck out this bitch. Like, trick hard. Because you know they're going to trick. They're going to fly you out. They're going to take you shopping. They're going to push you up. All that. Then they're going to get that content. And they probably never going to fuck with you again. But you gonna that whole little experience, you're gonna be feeling like, damn, damn, this nigga really fucking with me. No, he's trying to get some money, babe. So I do not fuck content creators, y'all. I that's the that's like why y'all never seen me like that. Like, I, I don't fuck no content creator. I'm a solo content creator. And when y'all do see me do collabs, it's definitely somebody I'm in a relationship with. And it's not like a random ass paid collab. And that's why y'all be like, oh, well, why you don't have this? Why you don't have that? It's because I don't be getting paid collabs. I'm not. Uh, there's no amount of money. I'm sorry. Like, 
sorry to bust your bubble, but there's no amount of money that can allow me to just let random men stretch me out. And I don't, listen y'all, listen, I don't want you to feel like I'm judging. I swear to God, I'm not judging. I'm not judging. This is just my, this is how I feel about it. Um, this is how I feel about it because I know I'm a Virgo and I'm sensitive and I feel like I would literally be sitting here crying um, because I didn't get this little pussy away. And, you know, this little pussy didn't been given away. And so, now that this little pussy didn't been given away and this nigga not answering his phone calls, this nigga is literally on Twitter fucking next bitch. I will be crying. You bitches is too strong for me. Yeah. Like... I don't, I don't, uh-uh. and I'm very territorial, like, once we start fucking and dealing with each other, like, you're mine, like, you're the fuck mine, like, I mean, listen, I'm so, like, I'm so, so locked in with the niggas I'm fucking with, like, my nigga could be peeing, I will come in there and hold that dick while he peeing, I will come hold it, I didn't put my hand in the sprinkle while he peeing, like, I didn't, what, what is you talking about? I didn't, like, you come home, I'm just putting my hand in your drawers, let me smell it, let me, let me suck it, let me suck the sweat off your fucking nuts. What are you talking about? That is my man, my man, my man, my man. That's my man. When we locked in, that's my man. That's why I don't be fucking around like that. Because I can't take it. I just can't, I just can't breathe if I see you. Oh, the way you was dicking me down last night and then you dicking the next bitch on camera. Y'all bitches are strong on camera, though. Like, we was just fucking, and then I go on Twitter, and I don't give a fuck how old the video is. I don't give a fuck. You're my man. I ain't never had to deal with that. I've never had to deal with that. Huh? What? We talk about this. Speak English, use your words, okay? Okay. Yeah, I ain't never had to deal with that. Am I in Miami? No, I'm not in Miami. I'm in Atlanta. Not in Miami. Not in Miami. Although I could really go for Miami right now. I'm not gonna hold you up. So like when I be in Miami, I be at peace. I be having so much fun. Oh, I like Miami. I already said it. I feel like I'm not feeling it in Atlanta that I'm going to Miami to live. Y'all know I switch where I live every three years. So we'll see. You from Iran? How is it up there? Are they at war? <laughs> Bro, what the fuck is wrong with me? I'm sorry. That's not something I should be asking. How are things where you live? How are things where you live? You would schedule a date right now. Why? Why would you do that though? When y'all think about me and y'all be like, oh, da 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 da, y'all think about fucking me, don't y'all? I know y'all do. That's why I don't be responding to y'all. I know y'all do. Hold on, y'all. 